didn't the uh didn't one of the devs one of the members of the dev team come on and uh like get all hyped on our twitter for killer instinct oh man awesome. i missed that yeah i missed that too All right, we're getting on. We get on into this winners finals right here. This is winners finals. Yep. Hmm. Uh, this is a this is gonna be a pretty easy matchup between Cloud and Zeus, dude. Samus. The only the only advantage I see is Cloud's big sword coming out. That being Zeus said, they both it. have disjoints throughout each other, though. Yeah. Cloud having the um, sort of gimmick with the limit and. King Chris with a bit of a speedier character being able to weave in and out as he pleases. Yeah, and I'd look for King Chris to maybe sort of uh, try to extend some of these edge guards as well, um, knowing that Cloud's recovery is pretty gimpable when he doesn't have limit on. Yeah. Uh, King Chris would be such a good person just to play against. Like, just to get better as, like, a Smash player, because he's so fast, and it's like... He is number one on the WWR, so you know. <laughs> it's, it's like getting a glint. It's it's kind of like getting a glint land play because the, he plays. He definitely plays like what a land player would be, like very fast, knows what he's doing, very precise. And I think oh. we'll a brilliant up air to oh, the conversion that was, there. That was good prediction skills right there. Um, King Chris has been playing Zero Suit for you know a really long time now, and. He just seems to have such a mastery over the character, and that type of thing only comes from, be from playing her for such a long time, so... Yeah. I, used to, I used to play her back in Brawl with Marth as well. She used to be, used to be pretty big with her. Now she's got she's gotten so much better, like, as time comes by. She's just so much faster. Also, just her hitbox is way better. Ooh, Ooh, I'm not sure what happened there. Right. The fast fall SD to dodge out of the the uh, yeah, limit cross him. slash. Yeah, oh out. God! It looked like the last, like the last little baby toe of that limit hit him, and may have uh, accelerated his fast fall a little bit. It did. I'm pretty sure it did. I don't know, I don't know how that happens because that wouldn't. That's not anything. Because he didn't hit the stage, right? No, he did not. not. Well, Matt's an even Matt. And it's, it's kind of as uh, as uh, zero six this right now. And Ooh, and a weird call out there from the limit cross slash all the way on the platform. King Chris nowhere near that one. <laughs> Goes for the hard read. <laughs> the yeah, hardest of reads. Doing some big boy predictions. Oh, he could. Oh, he could have cross slashed. Me. And a strong Zare there, but uh, Enhanced able to make it back still. King Chris is really good at, at getting these conversions off of the Zare. He always oh, goes yeah. for the Zare and then into uh, into usually a forward air or, or something off the stage. This clown needs to, he needs to throw out some more. Blade. There we go, there's the blade beam. He needs to get that pressure off of it. Because right now this is just, King Chris is just all over him. He needs... He needs to be pulling out those nares more, just to get her off the, get her off the top of him. He needs to have more ground control. Yeah. King Chris just waiting out the limit there, so, forcing forcing uh, Enhanced to just burn it. I think he's trying to just use the limit just to be able to match his, because it's just come down to it that he knows he's not going to be able to hit him. King Chris is really looking for this plasma whip kill as well. Uh, enhance at a high enough percent that it will kill. There it is. If I were him, I would save my limit for finishing touch because that has a wide range. It's not something I see a lot of clouds go for, and I yeah. have to venture guess that it's just not as disjointed as the other options he has with limit. Also, too, I think you know. I'd... Finishing touch is uh, somewhat hard to hit on Wi-Fi, I think, you know, having it need to be so precise, sometimes you can have that, like, phantom hit hitbox almost, like, yeah. even if you're right on top of them, so. 
Maybe just feeling a little, a little wary being on Wi-Fi trying to use it. Yeah, but being on Wi-Fi, you, you get used to it. Like, there's, there's a point where you do get used to it, where you do compensate for it. Like, you can definitely see it in a lot of, uh, in a lot of people who play online, like, a lot. A lot of people who play Wi-Fi tournaments, almost exclusively. King Chris getting enhanced up there to the uh, the kill percents. Again, just being really patient and waiting out limit every time he's got it. He's just kind of forcing him to kind of waste it. Strong cross slash read there, though. Right out of the parry, looking, too. It's a good conversion. Really, really looking for the berry as well. I, I think I think this is your Samus is in kill range of a... Uh... Of a side smash, honestly. Okay, now he, now she definitely is. So I would say this is a pretty even yeah, match. Yes. He's going for the hardest of reads, the up smash on the platform. <laughs> Halfway to another limit as well, but King Chris trying to end this stock before he can get there. This ain't now last hit of though. the plasma whip as well. Yeah, I get carried by our sim here. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay. Interesting choice from Enhanced to go for the air dodge on the stage there, because usually Cloud players do that to not burn their limit, but he didn't have it yet, and I thought it was a pretty safe option for him to go for the up B, but regardless, that mistake causes King Chris to get that solid edge guard, take the stock, take the game, and King Chris is up 1-0. Dang it, nope, it's Pokemon Stadium again. Right off the bat, this is there to the combo. He needs to he needs to challenge these Zares. He needs to be able to nair into them. Oh, and the, it could have got a bigger punish there off of the whiff grab, but kind of missed his opportunity. I don't know why he stopped uh, using the uh, cross slash. Also whiffing his uh his bears a lot, back bears a lot. Ooh, and the call out there with the limit edge just no, he might be dead, stock. he's dead. That's a stock. Oh, oh wow, he saved jump just for that. Hmm, he needs he just needs to be as aggressive as this is, so don't let out that way. You got, you got to be the dominant one in this match, right? Oh, oh, that's, that's, good that's good stock right there. That's stock right there. I've never seen this cloud before, but he's just nasty. He's alright. Right. This, this guy's a pretty good cloud. Ooh, good clash there. King Chris, again, putting an exhibition on it, spacing, because he, he's doing such a good job of spacing himself off uh, this cloud here with the with the Zares as well as the flip kicks. Yeah, but Enhance is, able, is like, he's so easily able to take it back. Like, there are, there are many times where he was able to get, like, 50% in just one combo. It's all based on just momentum for Cloud. I mean, cloud is a highly momentum-based character. True. I don't know. I'm surprised think... that he didn't hit a harder punish there. I thought, you know, he could have gone for a little bit more aggression there off of the. Uh... Nance is just getting beta right now. <laughs> he's just too. He's just getting scared. He's not taking the risk that he should be taking. It's just because Zero Suit is. I think like the whole thing about Zero Suit's name is, is you gotta be the is that you gotta be the one to be on the offense. Like there is no defense for Zero Suit's Sims. Yeah, and, and Enhanced just you know not doing a not doing too much to to 
put on a lot of percentage and going for some of these wild uh, callouts with the, the up smash on the platform or the F smash on the platform. He's, um, he's, trying to, he's trying to do almost a bait and punish strategy, but he's playing it too passive. And again, don't know what he saw there with the, uh, yeah. the he's uh, limit think blade beam. Cause I think he's trying to get a cheeky pick right there. Able to get the back air to seal the stock. 91%, not too bad, especially for him. Oh, alright. Looking pretty bad for him so far. And a mistake with the blade beam off the stage. That'll do it for King Chris, right. game two. It's uh, going straight back to Dang PS2. It. <laughs> it must be a it must be a comfort pick um, for uh Enhanced PV, he must just like playing on this stage. Cause yeah, I'm, I'm trying to think why he would um continue to go back there. I would say honestly go battlefield. Or not battlefield, final destination. Because because as you see right there, King Chris just used that platform to get away from him. And he's just able to roll on all on top of him. Wait. Oh, oh god. Close one definitely for enhanced PV, but able to make it back on stage but King Chris taking control and big call out there for the uh, limit blade blade beam. I keep wanting to call it blade meme. That should be a kill. <laughs> blade meme. <laughs> Someone posted that in chat earlier. And yeah. Now we can't now we can't unsee it. I can't unthink it now. <laughs> no, is it is it like the fish flop? <laughs> <laughs> Good, yeah, I was gonna say, that was one, I think one option that Enhanced definitely needs to be making more of a, an effort to use, especially in the closer quarters, because up the out of shield is really cloud, one of clouds, and a big oh, run up, oh, up smash that was a golf from Enhanced PV. Right even out the stocks, that was actually a huge even out for uh, Enhanced PV, bringing this one back. Now that was the risk we were talking about that Enhanced needed to take. He saw he Tinkers use a laggy option, and he went in there and then tried to yeah, and needs to be more, needs to be more risky, more adventurous in his lifestyle. Paying off there, who knows what he can do. Yeah, I know. I, and the limits, I mean, he's just trying to go for these hard reads. Stay for, for, for once, and do the blade beat. Ooh, that was a good read on that, though. Also, he, I don't... Enhance isn't using much of, like, the sword. He's not using, like, the sword range all that much. Because he's getting grabbed here and there. Because what you can do is you can do a forward air, but then you can also tilt. Ooh. Big greed on the back air there. Yeah. Catching the jump. Like I was saying, you can, use, you can do forward air, and you can press uh, back on the stick so you can... Shift your momentum backwards so you can hit with oh, um, no punish on the forward smash. Oh, but a big read from the. Oh, Here you go. oh, oh, that's a good so you're saying like we're about taking, some, taking some chances on some of these yeah. reads and they're paying yeah, dividends. He's starting to adapt. King Chris already in kill percent for uh, Cloud here. Oh, yeah. There we go. He's reading it. He's reading it now. And that should just, be it, yeah. There we go. I, just I was saying, he needs, just like there you say, he's the dominant one that real team battle. <laughs> it ended up like, like literally, like when all four of us are in here, it, no one else lagged except for him. So. Yeah, it wasn't. Uh, I think it was just on his part, honestly. Yeah, it must have just been him, because it's been fine literally this whole time that we've been doing it, so. Oh hey, it's Battlefield. It's no longer Pokemon Stadium. All right. Yeah, and and this is a this is definitely a counter pick from Chris. Like you said, the platform yeah. is definitely <laughs> way easier to uh to maneuver Dude, around Cloud with. Way so. easier to escape. But he is playing this pretty well. Yeah, he's he's doing it pretty pretty well right now. He got a percentage lead, but as I say that, King Chris takes it back. Almost gets the spike there, but good DI from uh, Enhanced to make sure he stayed on the stage. He's playing his shield too much. And again, tried to use the limit, but uh, got interrupted there. Ooh, Ooh had, that parried the up B, but got the, uh, got the final hit to back him off. Yeah. 
Now I'm in the bleachers. <laughs> oh, that was a good, that was a good read on that. Yeah, I'm not sure if you, I'm not sure if you, know, if you guys can tell, but King Curse is making the same patterns. I can, I can tell he's doing the same thing over and over again. It's Suppose always enhanced is picking up on that now. Yeah, what he's what, what King Curse is doing right now is he's just doing. Okay, what he's doing? He's oh, oh, a really oh, smart oh, blade oh, beam right there. Oh, 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 oh. And that boost kick might do it. Yep, that should be it. What he's doing? He's doing um, he's doing aerials, top of, of the top to get on his backside, and then he's doing combo starters. Like he's using the Z, he's using the air to get into a good combo starter, or is he he's using down smash so he can paralyze them. It's, it, it, that's his approach. Good to see you, G. Hope to catch you next time. In this game, pretty even right now. But, King Chris better be wary of, uh, of a, uh, a limit attack of some kind right here, because like you're saying, you know, King Chris has kind of been doing. There it is. He calls King Chris has kind of been doing the same things, you know, and now, uh, and yeah, he Hans is just kind of catching on to it. Yeah. There we go. See, he's been doing the, the uh, fish flop. Oh, I don't even care what he's calling anymore. <laughs> he either does a combo starter with an aerial, or he does a fish tail. Plasma, plasma whip, not quite able to get the kill there. But the next one should be able to do it right off the stage. Looks like King Chris is starting to respect enhanced options a little bit more now that he sees how well he's adapted. Here it is, the limit again if if uh King Chris, because if King Chris is able to, uh, or I'm sorry, if Enhance is able to get King Chris on stage, I'd look for that uh, that limit punish once again. Oh, and a okay. smart mix-up, actually. That was a pretty good, that was a smart mix-up just to be, be able to get back on stage. He'll probably be able to get limit once again right before uh, before this stock is over. It's King Chris playing it pretty passive and, and kind of allowing him to, to uh, get... Oh, but a really smart... Uh, down air from King Chris there. Punishing Enhance for being just a little too greedy. Some tactical crouches thrown in there as well. <laughs> the, the tactical crouch. Back air should do it. Yep, and it does. Enhanced. Even and out the stocks limit coming right up, 55% deficit, not too bad. Nah, it's definitely even match, especially with limit. And again, a nice read, solid 19% there with the limit uh, limit blade beam. But King Chris, almost with the conversion on the edge on the edge guard there. <laughs> Uh, Enhance better be careful with some of these uh, air dodge stages that quite like two or three times now, and you know I, I King Chris is probably starting to catch on. Another cross slash will give him fifty six percent. Not quite in oh, there we go. The down smash into the boost kick is gonna do it. King Chris taking the set. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I know it's not a fish flop. <laughs> Enhanced was showing a, a breath of fresh life there for a second, but ultimately a King Chris the fresh life. um impeccable execution. Gonna let him close out that set.